it seemed to me, but anyone I ever spoke to, and I've interviewed a lot of people who spend time at the Playboy Mansion, women who have posed in Playboy, it all kind of seems like the same M.O. When you get there off the bus, it's kind of like, well, we want to dye your hair blonde. We want to get you dressing a certain way. You know, my first day at the Playboy Mansion, I was in my acid wash jeans. You know, it's right. a rock T-shirt with my sneakers on with the little balls on the socks, you know, and they were like, you know, you can come to the Playboy Mansion closet and get dressed for the next time you come out. And I thought, well, what kind of clothes would be in the Playboy Mansion closet? Right. You didn't even <laughs> right? know. What innocent well, it little like Pamela. People wear clothes. It's almost like the Twilight Zone. They want to mold you into the same person in a way. David LaChapelle used to say going to the Playboy Mansion was like the Twilight Zone. Like he thought he saw a hundred of me from the back and then they would turn around and not be me. <laughs> right. It be, it, but it's true. Yeah. And then they move you in, right? I mean, like you get to get a room there and you live there and they feed I you and the whole thing. I wouldn't stay there. I wouldn't Why? stay there. I was nervous. I don't know. I mean, this is my spidey sense, my Mr. Magoo thing. I just always thought, even when I came here, the first thing they said was, well, you'll stay at the Playboy Mansion. I said, no, I'll stay at a hotel. Then I stayed at the hotel and they would call me and say, Pamela, we want you to come for a fight night. And I'd say, I'm not fighting anybody. They're like, oh, no, we're just coming to watch like Mike Tyson fight on the big screen. But I thought they wanted me to jello wrestle or something. And they said, no, you don't right. have to mud wrestle. You're fine. I said, okay, good, because I'm not. <laughs>